Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you are unable to install this KB5015882 update. So if you are unable to install this update on your Windows 11 computer, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to run update troubleshooter. For this, go to the start menu and then click on settings. Now go to system, scroll down, click on troubleshoot. Now click on other troubleshooters. Over here you can see Windows update, click on run. And once the troubleshoot is complete, restart your computer and then try to update your Windows 11 once again. Now still you are facing the problem, then restart Windows update and background intelligent transfer service. For this, type in services in Windows search box and then click on services. Now over here find windows update, scroll down, here you can see windows update, make a double click on windows update, make sure startup type is set to automatic and then click on apply, click on start if highlighted and then click on ok. With this selected over here, now click on restart the service. Now find background intelligent transfer service, make a double click, set it to automatic click on apply, click on start if highlighted and with this selected over here, now click on restart the service once again. Now once done, now you can restart your computer and then update your Windows 11 once again. Now the next step is to use Windows 11 installation assistant. For this, copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. Here you can see Windows 11 installation assistant. Click on download now. Now run this file. Click on yes to allow. Now over here you will see install option so click on accept and install and let the download complete once the download is complete restart your computer and your windows 11 should be up to date now now the next step is to use microsoft update catalog for this copy this link the link is provided in the video description open this link in a browser and write down the name of the update that is kb5015882 then click on search now over here you can see Windows 11 x64 base system, mine is x64 so you can go to settings, go to system and then click on about, here you can see my system is x64, so this is Windows 11 x64 base system, click on download over here. Now click on this blue hy hyperlink. Now once you click on it and if nothing happens, in that case, make a right click on the hyperlink, click on save link as and then you can save it to desktop and then click on save. You can set it to desktop, click on save and it should start downloading. So once the download is complete, I have to installing right now. So once the download is complete, run this file and then install the update, restart your computer and your windows should install this update. Now, then the next step is to reset windows update components. For this, copy all these commands. These commands are provided in the video description. So copy the commands still here. Type in notepad in windows search box and then click on notepad. Paste all the command in notepad. Go to file, then click on save as and then you can set the location as desktop and then name this file as wufix.bat wufix.bat save as type should be all files and then click on save now go to desktop over here you can see wufix file make a right click then click on run as administrator make sure that you're opening this file as an administrator so make sure that you click on run as administrator first of all it will stop all the windows update services and then it will run some scans. Now there are a couple of scans, so the scan will take some time. Once the scan is complete, it will restart all the Windows update services. Once the process is complete, now restart your computer and update your Windows 11. 
Now this process will take some time. So first of all, it will stop all the Windows Update services. It will run some scans. Then it will restart all the Windows Update services. Then restart the computer and then update your Windows 11 once again. Now, the last step is to use media creation tool. So if nothing is working, you can use media creation tool to update your Windows 11. Go to this website. Here also you will find media creation tool. Click on download now and then run this exe file. Click on yes to allow. Now this will load Windows 11 media creation tool. Now click on accept. By default, Windows 11 would be selected. Click on Next. Select ISO file, then click on Next. You can save the location. You can set the location as desktop and then click on Save over here. Now, once the download is complete, click on Finish and then go to Desktop, find Windows ISO file, make a double click on Windows ISO file, then run the setup file, make a double click on Setup file. Click on yes to allow. This will load Windows 11 now. And here you can see install Windows 11. Click on next. It will check for update. Then click on accept. Again, it will check for update. Now, before the installation, you will see the screen which says ready to install. And by default, the option to keep personal files and app would be checked. When this is checked, you will not lose any data on the computer. Click on install. After the installation, log into your computer. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to install this update successfully on your Windows 11 computer. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.